Hey everybody, this is Travis, your manufactured home nerd, uh, coming to you from River Lake Homes again today. Um, thank you for joining me on this beautiful house tour. Today we get to check out the Timber Creek Butterhatchie Extra. Never got a chance to walk this house, so we're going to learn a little bit about it together. But I did look up a little bit beforehand. It's a 32 by 64, four bedroom, two bath. Timber Creek is a well-built home. Offers some good options for customizing. And you can see here the house does have vinyl around the whole home, but they did a stone accent with board and bat. Vinyl accent on the front gives you a good color contrast underneath that dormer with three large windows. We're gonna walk in here and just check it out. One of the things I see off the bat, there is no carpet in the living room. They do have the flat molding all around the edge as well as painted sheet rocks with a light stomp ceiling. Coming in, you do have this foyer with the coat hooks, backpack hooks, whatever you want. Shiplap accent and boot cubbies as well as the bench to sit and put them on. I really like that. It is an open floor plan, but it's a little offset. So you have this large living room full of supplies right now, but I'm sure they're gonna finish it up. You can see that they were in the mid trim out process, but haven't quite finished. Come in here, you have huge six foot windows in your dining room kitchen area, large dining room area for a huge table, and this beautiful kitchen here. Rolled countertops, those are always great. Help, you know, limit the chipping as well as spilling. Large pot and pan drawers by your stove. Quite a few drawers in this house, as well as a lot of upper cabinets. And a little display case with the frosted glass there. And then back over here, you do have that is ceramic tile with a smooth top stove and a Euro hood. That stainless steel and glass is really easy to keep clean. And then you get the 60-40 farm sink. Got the nice split. These are wood doors and fronts on your cabinets. Really nice layout. If you set the TV on that wall over there, you could be in here cooking still. Keep your eye on the football game or whatever you like to watch. We come over here, right off the dining room, is your utility, your little AC closet there. Large space for the washer and dryer. It looks like you space to put a folding table if you needed to. Wire rack shelving above, a little breaker box and a little cottage door. And then there isn't a plug here, but I'm sure it's an option to add a freezer if you wanted. Access to your water heater as well. Let's go check out these guest bedrooms. I actually really like this layout. So it's, it's, it's open, but it still has some privacy, keeps your kitchen hidden from the front door. Large bedroom, I do like these doors here. Is that a five panel door? I like the look of them. And you can see the two by fours, it's a pretty solid house. Another transom window with the upgraded fiberglass tub shower combo that is bigger. I think it's 38 inches wide. Gives space for the kids to soak and and not feel cramped. Ceramic sink and metal faucets, four drawer stack, as well as an elongated toilet so you're not on that little round commode. This bedroom here, it's actually normally you don't see that where it transitions across the marriage line, but they did that so you could have a walk in closet on both of those bedrooms. I really like that idea. And there is no carpet in bedrooms either, so it helps keep it cleaner, longer, easier to maintain less allergies and of course the vents are in the ceiling i don't think i pointed that out yet that's always nice helps keep us cool here in the south all right let's go check out this master i've only got a chance to walk a couple of timber creek homes in the past and i really like them every time they have great design elements awesome color choices and just a really friendly staff there of course river lake as well they would be glad to help you with the timber creek now this is a large bedroom. You definitely have room for a king size bed, dresser, maybe even a vanity added in here. And those are huge windows. Let in tons of natural light, but those are those also those upgraded blinds that are two inches, cordless, easier to lift, less likely to break and twist. And then you also have this large walk-in closet. Those five panel doors do really show nicely, don't they? In your closet, you got a built-in sweater rack, wire shelving. 
I'm sure you could double hang some of this shelving. It is a nice walk-in closet. A lot of space there to put some clothes and other storage stuff. Now coming into this bathroom here, you have two sinks, large area, large door stack, as well as an extra cabinet stack there. And one huge mirror, I'm gonna try and get out of it. Don't wanna break it today. And then as y'all see right there in the mirror reflection, you have a six foot walk-in ceramic, maybe eight foot shower with bench seating, rain shower head, and just a really nice presentation. Fiberglass basin there, drain on the end, so you're not standing over the drain while you shower. And you have a little water closet cubby, space to put a little vanity or whatever else you want here, or a paint bucket as they did in this house. And then you got this huge deck tub. You could easily soak the days away and really enjoy it. You got the natural light coming in. It's places to put your candles and shampoos or adult beverage and more storage there. My house would have every lotion you can think of as well as towels. <laughs> so this is a great little layout, four bedroom, two bath, open floor plan built by Timber Creek. I am, I have been impressed every time I've been in one of their homes and they did not fail this time either. I want to thank y'all for joining me. If you like these tours, please don't hesitate to hit that subscribe button. We'd love to see you come back every week. I try and have two videos a little, little late this week uh, on a couple of them, but we will are getting back on track. If you'd like to see the Timber Creek or other homes just like it, I would love to show them to you. And if you have any questions or anything, don't be afraid to comment. I'd be happy to answer what I can or get you to somebody who can answer it. Y'all have a great day and thanks for joining me.